In archery, sin is missing the gold, which is in the center of a target and is referred to as a miss. Sin means to miss the mark or go wrong. But how do you know when you have gone wrong? In the Old Testament, the book of Exodus in chapter 20, the Ten Commandments are given to Moses known as the Law. They were instructions given by God for the people to follow. When one of these laws are broken, you are separated from God. It brings the person to the realization that they have missed the mark or have gone wrong. The commandments points you to the knowledge of sin in the Holy Bible. It tells us that we are all sinners and have fallen short from God's glory. Not good news, huh? But don't worry or despair because you can get right with God. This is Christian's story in Pilgrim's Progress. He is on the journey of getting right with God. Not only does he have a burden to be saved from the wrath of God, but so too he is carrying his burden of sin on his back, hoping to get rid of it, to get right with God and be saved from the wrath that will come. So Christian realizes he needs saving and it requires faith and repentance. Faith means to trust or believe in something or someone and repentance is a sincere action of asking God for the forgiveness of sins so that you can get right with him. This is where Christian finally loses his burden. He finally reaches the cross. To his amazement, the burden falls off his bag and rolls down into the tomb. At the cross, Christian finds salvation by realizing who and what Jesus did on the cross, that Jesus, the Son of God, died on the cross for the forgiveness of sins. It is only through Jesus and Jesus only that he could be saved. The Holy Bible's central theme is of Jesus, that he is the Messiah, who will save the world from sin. It was written and planned even before creation. Christian, full of joy and peace, was marveling by the death and resurrection of Jesus. Three shining ones came to him. The first one declared that he was justified, put right with God, sins forgiven, all of them, through Jesus Christ. The second one took off his dirty rags and replaced him with fresh new clean ones, signifying he was now made pure, spotless and accepted by God through Jesus. The third shining one set a mark on Christian's forehead and gave him a roll with a seal on it, so he could enter the celestial city. Then Christian gave three leaps of joy, singing his heart out.